Hello my darlings, it is Vlogmas Day 13 and I'm doing this a little bit later than I am used to doing my videos. Uh, it was just a busy day and that's all I can say. I keep meaning to like pre-record videos, but because I do the advent gifts, um, it's a little bit harder to pre-record because this is how I start off my videos is doing advent and I can only do advent like that day so I I don't know anyway it was a busy day it's um just about 7 p.m. my my time my lifetime hey um yeah about 7 p.m. so almost 5 p.m. in second life usually I do my videos around noon second life time but we're late today woo <laughs> Okay, um, so yeah, let's get started with Advent, and I actually asked my Plurk friends a question a few minutes ago, and so we're gonna go look at that once I'm finished with the Advent, and then we'll do some things, or a thing. I don't know, guys, it's, I don't know, anyway, 13, yay! <laughs> Okay, so we have a Christmas couch, and I don't know what store this is from, so I guess we're going to see, oh, Boudoir. Do I know this store? I don't know if I know this store. But we got a couch. Oh my goodness, that is quite the Christmas couch. Wow, that is something. That's really bright, too. I can totally imagine Santa Claus like sitting on this couch. It's just, it's super Christmassy. So they, they weren't kidding when they said Christmas couch. Cute. Okay, let's find one that is ladylike because hello, in a skirt today. Well, that might have to do for being ladylike and not showing our underpants. <laughs> But that's a really great couch. That is like super Christmassy. It's shiny and it's just it just looks like something that belongs in Santa's house. So that is a wonderful Christmas gift. And next up we have from Sway's. And let's see what Sway has for us today. Sway always puts her uh her gifts on Instagram, so until I open the gift I can't go on Instagram. So I haven't been on Instagram all day long. Let's see, ooh, fireplace. Ooh, how pretty. Oh, now I wanna change the fireplace again. Oh gosh. <laughs> that is so pretty with all those Christmassy candles. I love it. And then from Kitty Cats today, we have something from Rebel Hope. I love Rebel Hope. I'm very proud to be one of her bloggers, but I didn't realize she was doing um, advent gifts. So, what do we got here? We got boots, dress, and ears. Ears? Oh, well, this is a cute outfit. It's a really nice sweater dress with a belt. Very nice. And these kitty ears. <laughs> They have roses on them. Oh, I think I can pull them down, actually. Don't need to be so in the air. There we go. Kind of reminds me of um, Ariana Grande with her kitty ears. Cute. And then these boots. Some tall boots with the little garters. That's cute. What a Christmassy outfit that goes with that couch. That's awesome. I love it. Okay, I put my other outfit back on just because it took me so long to figure out an outfit earlier. Um, I didn't want to waste it. But <laughs> Plus, I never, I don't really dress up for these videos. I think I've been in jeans in like every video. Or at least tights and boots and stuff like that. So I thought today I'd be a little more dressy. A little clean up a little bit better than I have been. Not that I think it matters, but it, I don't know. There you go. <laughs> okay, so we did Kitty Gods, we did Sways, we did Mad P, and now is Avery Animations. 
have not seen what this is either. Even though he usually sends out a group notice saying what it is that we're gonna get, um, I didn't look at a notice or anything like that. Rideable cat bike toy, okay. Let's see, oh my goodness. <laughs> I love anything that I can ride in Second Life, so I am already all about this. This is also not for, well, I guess it's for adults. It'd probably look better over the kid, but... Oh! Oh my gosh! Look at my spider legs go! <laughs> go spider legs, go! Oh, I really should make my legs fatter, shouldn't I? Ugh, I love everything that I can ride on. I love it. Too cute. Okay, so yesterday when I was out at Winter Trend, and I twinned, oh my god. Yesterday when I was out at Winter Trend, I saw a jewelry set called Kala, and I remembered Kala hair, and then I said, oh, we should totally remember old stores that we liked and see if they're still in Second Life. And I think I said it so briefly that people didn't really pay attention to what I was saying. Either that or by the time it got to that part of the video, um, people got really bored during the whole, hey, let me show you how to sell Linda type of thing, <laughs> and they just didn't even watch to the end. But um, I wanted to see if any of the old stores, like the pre-mesh stores, were still in Second Life, if they had any kind of in-world presence at all. So I went to Plurk, because Plurkers are awesome, and I asked them to please tell me some stores that they used to love in Second Life. I didn't ask them to tell me if they were still around or not, so they don't really know why I'm asking. They just know that I'm asking. So I'm going to go over to my Plurk, and we're going to see some names, and then we're going to try to look some of them up in, uh, in World and see what we can see and see if they're... Or actually anybody still in Second Life, you know, that are still producing under the same brand name. It has to still be the same brand name. And if they're doing mesh or what they're doing. So let's check out my Plurk. Okay, so I said, okay, y'all, help me do a thing. I'm about to start recording a video. See, I actually started this Plurk, like, right before I hit record. And I went old names of old SL stores from 2003 to 2010, pre-mesh, basically, that you all used to love. Now I have some, everybody here who has said something, um, boop, <laughs> that's a few, Fiona uh, said Evald, and I already know the Evald is not in Second Life anymore, um, Girl 6, ooh, you know Girl 6 actually had The Sims still up, like, a long time ago, but like, longer than it should have been. So actually, let's look them up and see if there is still an in-world presence for the girl six. I don't think that there is anymore, but there used to be, like, up until, like, maybe two years ago. No, it doesn't seem like it. Was it girl, girl six, right? I said girl six here. Nope. Still has the update group, though. But, um, no Girl 6 hair. I used to love Girl 6 hair. That was, um, what is this? Anyway, um, yeah, I used to love Girl 6 hair. I thought it was great. But no more Girl 6 hair in Second Life. How sad. Let's see, Wrong. I already, I'm pretty sure that Wrong no longer has it in World Store. I used to love that store though. Night and Day, Got the Cats, Last Call, please. Ooh, those are some good ones. Got the Cats. I think they are still here. And I haven't checked out their store in the Cats with a Z or. Yeah. I haven't checked out their store in a long time. So they are still in Second Life. Um. I used to work at this place called Liquid Rage, and it was kind of a, uh, a club with a lot of cats. 
And so I got a lot of stuff and got the cats because that's what people were wearing. So let's go over there and we'll see what they're doing these days. I used to just love these clothes though because they were kind of sexy but kind of cute and um, urban-y type like grungy stuff too which was good for the club that I worked at. Ooh, free gift. What's up? Rigged mesh mid- Ooh, so they are doing mesh. Yoink. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's see what new stuff they've got. Oh, that's cute. And they make for Matreya bodies. Aw, oh, yeah. Ooh, I'm gonna have to come back here and shop because I just used to really love this store and it's been like three years at least since I've been here. And now that I know that they are making mesh and mesh that is rigged for bodies, I, ooh, this is cute. Um, I, I need to come back and shop because I didn't know that they were still making stuff. So, woohoo, more stuff to buy. I think I'm in stuff. Are these men's stuff rigged for slink bodies? Perhaps. Rigged mesh, one piece, full outfit. Oh, that's kind of cool, actually. Because sometimes it's hard for guys to dress themselves. <laughs> Not all guys, I know, but some guys. Um, backs. <laughs> yeah, because we totally need the same boot in like 27,000 colors. Um, Sassy Kitty, Exidy. I know Exidy is gone. Let's see, Can Canimal. Oh my gosh, did you guys know that Canimal came back? Like, come on, we're going. We're going right now, cause yes. So let me give you guys a little uh, Second Life history, basically. Way back in the day. There were four sims, and we called this the Quad. And the Quad was ETD, which uh, you all know now as Alika Tira Hair, Last Call, Canimal, and uh, Celestial Studios. And this was basically the sim, like the, the four sims that you would go to shop, and you could get everything there your hair, your skin, your clothing, your accessories. You could get everything there. And then in 2007, I think, yes, uh, the quad went dark for um, two, three days because um, Ginny Telemaska, the designer at Last Call, passed away and it was really sad. And it just seemed like after that, everything kind of fell apart for the quad. Um, so, yeah, so that happened. And it was really sad because those were some amazing stores. Cannibal was one of those stores, and everybody loved Cannibal. And she recently came back, like I want to say last month. And I am so excited. I haven't really been here to see what she has going on. Oh, and if you started uh, Second Life around the time that we had our CSI Sims, which was in 2007, because Second Life was featured on the show CSI, Cannibal was the one who made the outfit for the, uh, for the victim, basically, in the story. And... So everybody had that dress. It was like a black dress with some plaid on it or something like that. So it's really, really great to see Cannibal back in action. And um, ooh, some of the stuff is cute though. I mean, not that I would think that it wouldn't be, but you never know. Oh, I like that. But here's the thing. Is she making for Matreya bodies? <laughs> Let's see. Um, can't see in there. Uh, we may not be able to see in here either. No. Okay. So let's get this demo. And we'll open the demo up. Okay, so we didn't actually have to open the demo because this is a Matreya demo. <laughs> 
has his, um, and you can't see one of my arms because I have it, um, I had an outfit out, but this fits super well, and yeah, oh, that looks good though. I need to buy this dress. Let's get another demo. So this is Cassiopeia, and it comes from the Lara body, and that looks good. It's a little, little iffy here on the hip. Could just be my shape, um, because you can see it kind of goes like out a little bit, but that is okay because it probably is my shape. I don't have my hips very long, but cute. Oh my goodness. Um, sassafras. Look at this child of mine doing a shameless plug on <laughs> But, um, Abby actually does make stuff. Her store is called Sassafras, and she makes children's stuff, kids' stuff. She doesn't have an in-world store, but she has a marketplace. Um, she had an in-world store for very briefly, but I think she took it down. I don't know. She's working on stuff, and she's learning mesh, and she's getting really good, so woohoo! Okay, um, this have to be a store that's no longer around, if not Stellar. Well, this is Lexi's store, and Stellar has been around for a long time. And let's go to Stellar, because she actually, she makes really good stuff, so we should check it out. So, this is Lexi's store, Stellar, and she makes cute clothes. So, got some mini skirts here and sweaters and t-shirts and ooh cute cute and she also does makeup so if you want that Kylie Jenner lip look this is where you gotta come because she does some great lipsticks and also some eyeshadows and eyeliners and um, some little rainbow freckles there but Oh, and some nail polishes for your slink hands. So that is Stellar, and Stellar has been around since 2003, 2004, something like that. So it's really good that she's still around and doing her stuff. Sin Skins, that is a store I have not thought about in a long time, and they used to make some really nice skins that... Um, and they would do like hunts and all this sort of stuff and they were really generous with, with things so let's see I don't think they're still around sinful, de sinful needs demon skins no 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 let's pick one more Ayo Haru I think that's how you pronounce it, I'm not really sure. But they were a really good store, and I don't, I feel like they started to do mesh and then just stopped. So I don't actually know if they're still here or not. Nope. Nope, doesn't appear to be just a group left. Oh well. Well, that was kind of a fun excursion out into Second Life to see some old stores and remember ones that we loved before. What were your favorite stores in Second Life way back in the pre-mesh days? I would love to know and to reminisce with you guys. Because, um, you know, if you're newer, like, really nice clothing... <laughs> This is about all you know. Like, everybody's walking around looking pretty good and everything. But way back in the day, we didn't look that great, but we thought we did. And it was really, it was fun. But let me know your old favorite stores. And if you know if they're still around, let's check them out together. But if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and hit the subscription button. And also that little bell next to the subscription button. Um, just so that you can always know when I have updated and uh, done a video and all that good stuff. But until next time, I love you guys and I'll see you soon.